Welcome to, to Mother Daughter, Daughter Projects. Projects. I'm Seth. I'm Vicki. A few weeks ago, my 88-year-old dad was surfing the internet and he came across this new product by Rust-Oleum. And he asked me if I had ever heard of it and I said, no, but let me do some checking around and I'll let you know. Not even a week later, on this website called Creator Studio, which is an online community created by Rust-Oleum, they announced the product. It's called Recolor, and this was exactly what my papu was talking about. Basically, you wipe this on a surface, a dull surface, and it brings the color back to life, which seemed really interesting and something we definitely wanted to try out. Well, as luck would have it, Creator Studio offered the first 100 people to sign up a free sample of the product, so when we got our product, tried it on all kinds of things. And we wanted to share a couple of those things we tried it on with you today. In the box, you'll find a bottle of the Recolor liquid, a microfiber sponge, small brush, gloves, microfiber cloths for applying the product, a wipe with the product already applied, and instructions. I clean the surface of my checkerboard table to prepare it for recolor. I opened up the white packet and wiped the product on. As you can see, it made the color shine again, and after it dried, it still looked bright. Next, we headed to Mom's house to bring the color back to her front door. We used it on the painted door and metal handle. In the end, it brought a nice color back to the door and the handle really shined up too. I also tried recolor on my outdoor fire pit. I only used it on the outside rim, but you can see the rust is a lot less visible now. It also shined the legs very nicely. What we learned! I found one of the best uses for this product is on black wrought iron furniture. Tables, planters, things like that. It really brings back that rich black color that it originally had. I have a lot of that at my house as well, which I tried it on and it works perfect. Not easy to take pictures of, so you just have to trust me on this. And I did try it off label. It says not to use it on glass, but I wanted to try it on painted glass because that tends to fade when it's put in the dishwasher. Here to say it does not work, but I did try it on Pyrex and it gave it a beautiful shine. But if you're a collector, I would not do that because it will devalue your pieces. But for me, I wanted something shiny and bright and it was perfect. I will tell you, this smells pretty bad. So make sure you wear a mask and you wear, use it in a well-ventilated area. And use, follow as manufacturer's instructions because it's always a great idea. <laughs> and remember, you can find out more at motherdaughterprojects.com. One thing to note, it smells really bad. It's terrible. Just, follow the directions. Well, uh, just, uh, I'm talking I'm now. Did I talk during your pirate speech? No, I waited till you were done. Sounds like pirate.